on Night of Primetime Boxing, Saturday on Sky Sports Box Office. To order, see Channel 491, press the green button or go to skysports.com slash brookgallery. IFL TV in association with MGM Marbella. I'm here with the O2 today for the Royal Britannia weigh-in. And I'm with British title challenger Nick Blackwell ahead of his fight with John Ryder. Nick, you've just weighed in, you've had your banana, you've had a drink. How do you feel? Got spot on, mate. Got spot on. Loads of energy. Did struggle a bit of weight, to be honest. So, yeah, I feel real good, mate. Wait, I uh, look forward to tomorrow now. You've had some tough opponents before. Everyone knows you as a bit of a goer. You're a proper war horse, as they would say. You've had some tough opponents in Billy Joe Saunders, as John Ryder's for him as well, but Sergi Kamitsky as well. Do you think that sort of ed makes you edge the fight? Um, it gives, like I said, it, it, it's put me in place that John Ryder's never been before. You know, I'm going to put um, John Ryder in place tomorrow night where he's never ever been before. So, in that aspect, yeah. yeah. You've had a bit of a change in trainer, you know, with Gary Lockett up in Wales. What's that been like? Spot on, mate. Yeah, we clicked really well. Training's on spot on, camp's gone well. All the lads in the gym are really good, you know, so always competing against each other. Like, good sparring. Yeah, so training camps, good spot on. Like you said, you've only been in there for about two months. People have questioned whether that's long enough to like, adapt a new style to get rid of someone ready for a British title fight. Has it worked? Yes, yeah, right, mate. You know, I had it all there anyway, so he didn't, didn't need. He just had to keep telling me. Had to keep telling me to use the things that I wasn't using. Um, and yes, yeah, right. Like only a couple of weeks, so I was learning things straight away. So yeah, two months. Yeah, Why Gary Lockett? Um, I was at a sparring. I've been sparring there for years. Me and got click well. You know, a bit of banner. You know, it's good. I have a bit of banner in the gym. Um, uh, yeah, we just. It's, yeah, it was one of them. You know, it was one of them. All right. He. <laughs> there you go, man with a dog. Man with a dog. Go and have a photo with a dog. Come here. Come and have a sit here. Go on, let's have a On top. Do you want an iPhone? Wait. Oh, sorry, you can see me. Wait. He's got one. He's done. Wait. 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 Both look at the camera. Wait. It loves it. Made for cameras, dog. It's made for cameras. Wait. <laughs> All right. We're good, we're good. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah. Great stuff. There we go. Yeah. There you go. Unexpected yeah. dog. You ain't allergic yeah. to dogs, are you? Nah, I got a dog myself. Oh, that'd be good. <laughs> <laughs> he's Welsh. Yeah, he's Welsh. He's got, he just must know you. Yeah, he must have. He's such a small face. There somewhere, you know? <laughs> have you ever been photobombed by a dog before? What's that? Have you ever been photobombed no, by a dog? No, it's the first time. First time for everything. First time for everything, yeah. Speaking of wows, and what's it like living away from home? Do you know what, I thought I'd hate it, you know, because I like staying in my little routine, but I don't know, I actually loved it. Getting away from everyone and everything, you know, you say, oh, do you want to come down and have a coffee and like this and that, you know, just focusing on boxing, uh, no stress, and yeah, it's, it's been really good, I've really enjoyed it actually. Have you got any tactics going into the fight? Yeah, the tactics, I'm going to take each round as it comes. Um, Gary Lockett will be on my case every round, telling me things to do. Um, I'm going to listen to Gary, um, so I know the advice that Gary gives me is going to work against John Ryder. I've got another question for you. Can anyone beat Gennady Golovkin? <laughs> um, in the middleweight division, I don't think so. You know, I think Martin Murray, you know, he done well against. I mean, he's a tough boy, Martin Murray. He's world class, and Golovkin can put him away. You know, so I like to see him before he gets Carl Frotch. I think, uh, or Sal Alvarez. One of those two fights be an interesting fight. A bit an insane fight. Oh, Carl Frotch. Look, he was trying to call that Joe Calzaghe. I think that that, that ship has sailed now, but. <laughs> Do you know what, Joe Cowell's like, I think he's one of the best fighters we've ever produced. You know, I used to love watching him as a kid, so, yeah, it was, yeah, Carl Frotch should be called that Joe Cowell's like, you know, he's retired, so. Alright, well, Nick, good luck tomorrow with the British title. If you win, you go on to big when? things. When you win, when you go on to big things. Actually, I've got to sit on the fence here, so if you win, <laughs> I, I can't, I can't be too much like that. But anyway, best of luck, and the best man wins, yeah. and goes on to better things. Oh, so Cheers, buddy, thank you. Thank you. Primetime Boxing, Saturday on Sky Sports Box Office. To order, see Channel 491, press the green button or go to skysports.com slash Brooke Gavin.